what's up guys i uh, just got my order of the new dsd decoys the ace 2.0 uh, it's been a two month wait but uh see if it's worth it or not used to have the old dsds but they were just too big and bulky and it's quite a few things i didn't like about them including the head connection which uh absolutely sucked so we'll see what these guys look like Uh, the first thing I noticed right off the bat is the size, obviously. Um, they're a lot smaller than the original DSDs. I would say pretty close to almost half the size. Um, definitely the material feels a lot more thicker than the previous ones. Uh, they were just super inconsistent. Some spots were super thick material and some spots were thin. This seems more uh, thick material all the way around. Not bad. Uh, difference got the legs attached now. Uh, I'm not sure what this hole is for. Maybe some just the air in and out of the thing. But uh, here's the feeder. It's not that bad. Pretty sweet looking. Let's just see what uh, the rest of these look like here. And the bases. So it looks like they made the switch to square bases this year. Let's see how those fit and work. It's about right size, I guess, of a standard honker. Um, I think it's way more accurate than what they used to have anyways. But uh, I'm cool with that. That doesn't look bad at all. Uh, with no bungee on, there's a little bit of movement. Let's see if we... Uh, the feeder pack. I end up getting nine dozen altogether. Um, not a bad way to spend 6300 but whatever. It is what it is. So I'm gonna check out this um, ruster pack. See what's good in here. So that's one of the, uh, the rusters, or I guess it could almost look like an active, I guess. Um, not bad, looks pretty good. I'm surprised there's not a little bit more feather uh, detail on the tips like the previous honkers, but um, I don't really care about that. It's not a big deal. It looks pretty decent. They're definitely darker than the previous models for any of you guys that ran those Ace uh, one piece or uh, two piece. They're definitely um, darker than that. That's basically what this guy looks like. Not bad. Um, I like it, especially how they split the tail now, which is kind of cool. Uh, makes it look a little bit more realistic, I guess, if you want to say that. We'll see if we have another one we could look at. This kind of looks like how they had the Z-neck pose on the previous one. It's kind of seamless. Very similar to that. Um, kind of looking retarded a little bit, but... We'll see what this guy looks like. So again, not bad. I don't mind the size at all. I was expecting them to be a little bit bigger, but I'm not super uh, disappointed about that. Just actually want to see what these uprights look like. So we get the upright, or one of them anyways. A little bit of flocking messed up a little bit there, but uh, that's not bad either. It's got a little bit more feather detail too in the head, which makes no difference, but I'll see what this guy looks like on. So that's basically that. A little sloppy with the flocking kind of, but It'll wear off I'm not really too concerned but the looker upright rest there rest there and another feeder 
Um, looks pretty legit. Let's see what else we got. It's the high head looker, or just the normal, I think, or strider, or whatever they want to call it now, but um, looks pretty cool. Definitely like the one piece better. The other head connection was actually a joke on the old DSDs for the amount of money you pay. Um, it was a pretty crappy design, but uh, these look look better. So it just shows you what the upright looks like, which isn't bad. So they overall pretty good. Definitely the molds are more consistent in the thickness. Shape smaller, definitely a, a darker color for sure. There's no doubt about that. Um, I haven't even played around with the motion at all, which I really don't care about um, at all. So this is it, the new Honker, um, the DSD's 2.0, Ace 2.0. So it's about a six week wait, I think at this point when I ordered it was two months, but I sold off my other rig. So I really didn't have much of a, um, of a choice so I don't know, tell me what you guys think you think it's worth it or what I know you can kill birds over anything it's more location but uh they're pretty sweet looking decoys for sure